What's up? Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's Boy Swipe Boom here with another mukbang video. What's going on? First shout outs, requests, and dedications. Make sure to hit up all our social media platforms. I'm going to leave all the information down in the description box below. I always say I'm going to put links down there, but I never do. It's just you go down there, see what I typed, go to the search bar. Type you it do up. have links. Do I have links? You have love for first bite there. You remember? Because I I did that too. Oh really? Yeah, I, I helped you. Oh well, hey, there you go. I got links down there. Go and hit the link to go to our most <laughs> active um, social media platform, which is Love at First Bite Vlog Instagram. That's the, we actually did a whole bunch of. Where did we go today? Tell them where we went. We, we went, went to, to uh, Car Wash. No, no, da, no, Dallas Mill. The ones that we did Instagram for. Mm. Dallas Mill, we got a, a sandwich and we got um, some frappuccinos from uh, Cozy Cow. Anyways. And who felt horrible after? Oh my God. I'll, I'll talk about that later. But anyways, love at first bite vlog. You can see all the behind the scenes things about our lives because it's a movie. Instagram, it. love at first bite vlog. Go check it out. Anyways. So, uh, we didn't want to go and like buy something. Um, we had some leftover chicken. That needed to we, be used. Yep, we had some leftover tortillas that needed to be used. They were technically expired. But you know, once they you fry... They've been in the once, freezer. Yeah, once you fry something... Well, they've been in the fridge. Once you fry something, just take, you know... And if it, if you get food poisoning, take the L, like a man. Free diet, you know? But hey, so, we, so what she did was she shredded up the chicken. I put onion powder, garlic powder, taco seasoning paprika cayenne pepper and then i fried it up in butter and then um thumbnail. that's not the thumbnail that's a horrible thumbnail you don't know how to do thumbnails you've been in this game for a while no, dig in. no i'm talking they know that i'm supposed to talk until six seven minutes and then and a bunch of idiots comment below this isn't dolce Fruity, okay this is we in the hood right now this suave boom i get to act like this i'm sorry Ladies, ladies and gentlemen, look at this. That, doesn't she look cute? She looks beautiful today, right? She did herself off. She was mm, very sexy. Just for the video. I was trying to get her to like wear something like you know, thirst trappy. This is kind of thirst trappy, but, but it's, it's like hidden. it's like half show your boobs, but like in a classy way. Like I'm trying to get some views. Anyways, <laughs> let's get the thumbnail going. Okay, finally. <laughs> what was that? No. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay. Okay, dig in. So I basically just um, seasoned mm. up some chicken, uh, and I fried it up in some butter, put in a okay. corn tortilla with some cheese inside, wrapped it up, fried it. Mm. And then I uh, topped it off with some more cheese on top. Sour cream. So much better than that frozen one. Oh my god. Mm. It doesn't taste like mom's chicken tacos, but it has like the same vibe. Like it's like a cousin of those or something. No. Right? Let me get in here. Mm. Mm. Salsita. But a crema. Yum. Actually, with the salsa and the. Uh, is it sour cream or crema? Sour cream. With these, it totally is like a sister to mom's chicken salad. <laughs> What's Rocky helping, helping pumping them up? Which one it is? Tell us which one it is. Spicy guac from Publix. Look at that snapple. Yeah. I already had it. Mm. I'm not I'm just. My my foundation doesn't look bad now. Maybe I shouldn't change it. I was thinking my new foundation, which is Bare Minerals. 
uh, was too reddish. I tried a different shade. Well, I was going to return it, but it doesn't look too reddish now, does it? Or, I don't know. It's good with the guac, too. Guac, guac. Mmm. Guac, guac. Get it? Got it. Cool. Ah. Today and day we went for a hike and saw a snake. And um, then we went to car wash with Rocky and Sagma. It was a nice day. That like when you say it out loud. It sounds lame. <laughs> yeah. It sounds stupid, like, oh, that was cool, awesome. Hope you had a blast at the car wash. And Rocky was on a leash next to the vacuums while we vacuumed all the insides and wipes in here. He was trying to climb on top of me while I was sitting in the car like, mommy, mommy. <laughs> Yo, you know what it is? It's all out of our system. Everything. Mm -hmm. I met my beautiful wife at, at the best time of my life, and she met me at her best time of her life. Mm -hmm. We're all partied out. It's over. Everything we've done that 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 younger uh, people do, it's it's done. Are you alright over that? Mm -hmm. Damn. Mm. It really is out of my system. Like I don't even find it appealing anymore. So like doing normal stuff. Like we woke up in the morning, ran a couple errands that we needed to take care of some business. Hang out with Rocky the whole day. He went with us everywhere. Went on that little hike. Talked about the dumbest things in the world like we always do. Enjoyed each other's company. <coughs> the, the, the weather was just awesome. Um, talked about how your parents are going to come here soon. And, mm. you know, things like that. Our future plans. Well, we saw and... a baby snake. <laughs> and I sent my parents in a group chat. I sent them multiple videos of our hike. Last one was the snake, and of course, that's the only thing they could talk about. How it's so dangerous, which it is. Snakes, kind of. snakes in that region. Move away. <laughs> no, a baby snake is way more venomous than. Okay. Mostly my mom. I mean, they're right, and we're trying to like Snapchat it. My mom is like freaking out. And then my brother is like seeing my mom freak out. He was like, I think it was an anaconda. <laughs> <laughs> no, Duoma said that. Yeah, my brother. Yeah, Duoma. Yeah, your brother. Yeah. I have two brothers. Yeah. He was like feeding into it. He was like, I think oh, it was. Oh, wait. An uh, it wasn't. It was Duoma from Sweden. It wasn't Auntie. Mm. Yeah. Okay. That's hilarious. Mm. And, then we, and then we went to Petco and no, bought Rocky. PetSmart and bought Rocky some high bowls. Oh my god, they had cats in PetSmart. Like you know how they bring them in the de in the morning for the day, and then they pick the foster home picks them up again in the evening if they didn't get adopted. Yeah. I was into the Birdos. Your your stomach was hurting. Oh yeah, we just came from Cozy Cow, and I had an awesome. Caramel macchiato frappuccino with the foam and the whipped cream. I don't know. I don't. I don't know what the drinks are. Mm. But it was delicious. No, I was knocking on the window for the cat. Like the little boy, like come on, come on. He was like, I was like, let's go. I don't. My stomach hurts. I'm an old man. I can't. Like it's like so I want to. It's like I want to eat that stuff. Like I want to eat whipped cream and caramel and. Everybody's like, are you lactose? I don't know what I am. I don't know. Am I going to go to the doctor and get checked up? No. I'm Mexican. All right? You know what the cure to the, my stomach hurting was? Take the L for 10, 15 minutes, drink a bunch of water, and went away. Yeah, and we can we can find out the reason later. Like, I, I want to fix it. Yeah, me too. Well, I'm not going to go to the doctor so he can tell me the same thing. 
We just don't eat that stuff. I don't tell me about it. <laughs> but weren't the cats cute, though? The cats were cute. We kind of want a cat. Yeah. Who in the comment section? Don't tell me. Tell them. Tell me in the comments if you know what we want to name our cat. We actually have two names, right? One is, mm, you don't remember the other one for the yellow? The um, yellow? Yeah, I do. <laughs> Shit stain. <laughs> <laughs> That's not it. Leave it in. <laughs> ah, girl. Leave it in the comments if you can guess. Or who no. knows? No. Trina might know. I probably told her a million times. She knows one. She knows the number one. Yep. She won't know the second one too. You posted up a video the other day. That was nice. Mm -hmm. About time. Gina. I am excited for the April collab coming up. Um I go I'm I'm like this with with my channel. Um sometimes I'm consistent, sometimes stuck. I'm not. Um I like that lately I've been, I don't want to say like networking more, but I, I, you know, just if I like a channel, I talk to them, I share, and they share my stuff, and it's slowly but surely just growing, and I don't know, it's like, I get into these like one or two week uh, stints of uh, whatever when it comes to networking on YouTube. Um, um, like that, like one YouTuber I was talking to you about earlier, she has about 60K on her YouTube, and then her Instagram is like 40, 50,000 followers. So it's like her YouTube is equal. But if you look at anybody's channels who has a successful YouTube channel, their Instagram never matches what they have. So I guess my whole thing is, what is the secret to keep up to, to keeping up your YouTube equal with your Instagram. And uh, this particular person, uh, it, her name's Tway Bebe, and she's like, I don't know if anybody anybody's into YouTube, like old school YouTube, but Timothy Delaghetto's best friend, Ricky Shucks, that's like his girlfriend, whatever. And uh, she does, I don't know her name, but her YouTube name is Tway Bebe, I think. And she does like mukbangs and vlogs, like the same style that this channel is. And I reposted one of her things and she replied and everything. And I asked her that question a while ago. But I do think you're right. I think it's because cause she hangs out with famous YouTubers. Do I need to start hanging out with famous but have YouTubers? You, have you guys noticed how every, almost every YouTuber never gets the same, never gets 100% the same amount of views as their subscriber count. So if you have, like we have 30K, we our views are pretty low. They're like... Between 20 and 20 percent of our our subscribers watch mm -hmm. our view oh. our because so our views if we have 30k our views are between three and six on yep. on like on a on a normal video mm -hmm. sometimes we you know get, go higher sometimes we go right. lower but between three and six thousand so that's between that's between 10 to 20 percent of our subscribers watch our stuff but mm -hmm. if you have 300,000 followers which is you know one more zero then have you noticed that those people too only have like 60k, 60K views, views 50 so that's views. also 60k views is like 20% of their subscribers actually watch their videos but they yeah. also like there's a lot of channels where like They'll post a seafood boil and they'll get like a million views. Mm -hmm. But anything else they post, it's only like 50k, 30k, 60k. Huh. And I guess my whole thing with her channel is that so she funny. has 60k followers and like 45k or something followers on Instagram. So it's like, how are you doing that? I want to eat. Oh, another thing, fuck seafood boils. I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm not doing it. Don't ask me. I might do it. No. I might do it. No. Maybe. What if we get like a good deal, like a Sam's Club? Can you go get Talenti? Oh, the ice cream? Yeah. 
Come on, Rocky. Because I'm over this. I'm so full. I don't want to keep. Don't look at. Don't look at my PJ pants. <laughs> Is the front part it, it's closed? Like, don't look at the front part. There's no button. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes things things be peeking. You know, there could be a little peeking cheeking. Let me cover that up. <laughs> yeah, you butter. <laughs> You know what I mean, I don't want these, I don't want these ladies gasping and swooning, you know. Did you Goodness gracious, spoon? I caught the vapors. I don't have a spoon, remember we ran out of them. You could have brought a big one. We don't do uh, dishes around here, you feel me? <laughs> I'm going to use the avocado. There, there's right here, right here. Talenti, you see how bright it is? Best Ta ice cream ever, I swear to God. Talenti this Southern Butter Pecan. I swear to pecan God. Pecan so or pecan good. or pecant? Pecan. I would say pecan. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep pecan. going. I'm gonna keep Which going. one would you say, pecan or pecan? Um. Oh my God! It, smells it just reminds pecan. me of like Puerto uh, Puerto Rican, like pecan Rican. I say pecan. Why did I blow on it? <laughs> it's that cold. I was just... It's that cold, yo. Mm. But you know. And I know the end game when it comes to networking and collabs with other channels. Ooh, Avengers end game though. Oh, that's another. Mm -hmm. um, is to get more views and more subscribers. Yes, it's Avengers, but, not Avengers. It's Avengers. Lord. Don't you agree? Come help this woman. You say Avengers now too. I never say that. But like I was saying, um, I would just like this community to feel like it was between 2014 and 2016. That it's was never fun. going to. I know, but I want to... There's so many randoms. Leave in the comments below, whether you're a YouTuber or not a YouTuber, what is the best way to network with other channels without feeling like you're sucking up or kissing butt, because I don't do that. I suck toes. <laughs> she knows. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Though her big toe, though, is like... Ah! <laughs> I'm actually. You know what it was? The last video, you're, I was way too nice because you were on here. There's you, a little pecan. You make this. You make this channel too classy, and you make me not act up. You know, and I'm not about that life. Mm -hmm. Who else here? <clears throat> like I has. I just have this opinion where. No eating ASMR videos. People who watch those videos, which is a lot of people, they're there for the food. They don't care. They don't want to care. They don't want to know who the no. ASMR no. artist is. No. They just want to see the food. I'm over no talking videos, seafood boils, and what else? What else do we want to hate on? <laughs> <laughs> What else do we want to hate on? So YouTubers that are watching this right now, they be like, I just ate a seafood boil. I mean, what do you know? What else? Big ass microphones. Hmm. Green screens. Oh, I'm over green screens. Show screen. your apartment, all right? I'm so, we all poor. All I'm, right? so we all poor. I'm so over green screens. <laughs> Who here loves green screens? I Remember I when you like did them. that? Remember when you did this green screen? Mm. Hilarious. I didn't have a real one. Yeah, but we took a photo of the bedroom, remember? And we, we, so we made people think that you were still here in the States <laughs> when you were in Finland. <laughs> we paid like yeah. $50 for it. <laughs> 100%. Or was it was already. Nobody said nothing, except for one guy, but it went straight to your spam folder. Because you put keywords if anybody says green screen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I had all comments on approval. Hundred percent, hundred percent. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, we don't fuck around, all right? We see. Well, I was sad to be apart from you. I didn't want to talk about it to anybody. Well, I got that effect. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> I'm saying. What's the ice cream? Fuck. What? I was doing my fuck boy imitation. Yeah, I want some ice cream. No, I don't want ice cream. Remember this? No. Oh, good. 
Oh, well, thumbs up the video if you like it. Thumbs down if you don't. <laughs> Comment and subscribe. And we'll let you in the next video. All right, y'all. Um, that, that came it. out out of nowhere. Peace. Peace.